Hey, what's up? In today's video, we're gonna take a look at the Xiaomi Wi-Fi Home Plug or Xiaomi Wi-Fi Cat. Let's go. We have got the Home Plug Starter Kit. This kit consists out of a host device and a sub device. These devices are meant to be plugged into your wall socket to extend the reach of your Wi-Fi network, even when these theoretically not overlap. So it's really a great product for larger houses where there's a lot of Wi-Fi dead spots. They also have separate sub devices if you need more than the one that's included. How this Wi-Fi cat works is pretty magical, but in theory it's not that complicated. You plug the host device into a wall socket and connect that with your router over an ethernet cable. This allows to magically carry the internet signal over your home's electrical wiring. The sub device can be plugged into any other power socket in your home and it will basically grab that connection that's on the electricity line and creates a Wi-Fi signal from that point. It's good to know that the host device does not create a Wi-Fi signal as that is just used to convert your signal to the electrical wiring. You can add up to seven sub devices to a single host device, but the host can technically transfer data between three sub devices at the same time. If you happen to have one of the Xiaomi routers, it will actually adapt and use the same Wi-Fi network that the Mi router is broadcasting, which is actually really convenient. The device can work with any other type of router that has an Ethernet out port, but you gotta keep in mind that this will create a new Wi-Fi network if it's not a Xiaomi router. The device can handle any voltage between 100 and 240 volts, so it should theoretically work everywhere. The sub devices broadcast a Wi-Fi signal of 2.4 GHz with a maximum speed of 300 Mbps. The installation is pretty easy actually. Plug in the host device into the wall socket near your router and connect the host with your router's LAN port with an uh, ethernet cable. Plug in the sub device into any power socket and it should receive signal from that host. Once it's powered on you can set it up as a new device in the Mi Home app. The first time I've set it up I've used the Xiaomi router and that automatically took over my existing Wi-Fi name and password. So any device I tried connecting with that network actually connected right away. And in the Mi Home app, I can select to automatically adapt to my existing network or change that to something else if preferred. Just one thing that Xiaomi mentions in the manual is that the strength and the quality of the signal depends on the quality of your electrical wiring, as those are used to transport the signal. And trust me, the electrical wiring situation in my apartment is pretty much as bad as it gets. A few weeks ago I installed some of these Wi-Fi cats for my parents and there I've set up one sub device on the first floor and another one on the second floor. And even though these power sockets were on different electricity groups, they are all working great. To conclude, if you have a large home with uh, poor Wi-Fi reach because of very thick walls and doors, this device might be exactly the solution that you're looking for as regular Wi-Fi extenders might not work in your situation. This device breaks the boundaries of Wi-Fi extenders and it allows you to have good Wi-Fi connection all around the house. So I give this one a 10 out of 10 for its functionality and uh, that's about that. I hope you've learned something today about the Xiaomi Wi-Fi Cat. If you like these videos, don't forget to give a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. As always, thank you guys for watching and I hope to see y'all soon. Peace.